You're watching ETN, where we don't do news, we just talk entertainment. Share and subscribe. Hey guys, welcome to Entertainment Talk Nation. This is Rob. This video, we're going to talk a little Jurassic World. Yes, Jurassic World. And as we all know, a couple of weeks ago, they stopped filming. Yes, filming has ended. You guys know this. Uh, it's no surprise. It's been about a week since they, uh, well, it's about, about two weeks maybe since they stopped. And I think the big question now is when will we see a trailer? When will we see a trailer? Uh, well, I mean, if you, the movie comes out next year, uh, around the summertime, so I would say it makes perfect sense if you use the same, uh, formula we did for the Godzilla movie and then even some other movies, usually trailers tend to come out anywhere between four to six months before the movie, so you're looking at anywhere from probably this winter, December around there, uh, leading into probably January, February. So that's when I think we'll see one. Now, as a surprise, I also think there's a chance we might see one uh, during Interstellar. Maybe there's a chance of that, maybe around that time frame. But I think we're going to see a Jurassic World trailer probably uh, more likely between December and February, uh, either the end of this year or early next year. Maybe even the Super Bowl. Super Bowl might be a very good spot for a Jurassic World movie um, uh, trailer, that is. So, you know, that, that's basically it. I mean, it's going to be a little bit before we see one so but I mean it's done I mean that's it the, the movie's done obviously this is the time of the where they start putting the finishing touches and they really hit the ground running in the studio you know doing the CGI adding the effects uh, probably don't have to do as much because there were some practical effects used but you know usually with practical effects they'll, they'll use CGI to kind of enhance the look and maybe add a couple of things that they couldn't do uh, themselves but nonetheless, I think there will be a trailer within the next, you know, four, five, six months, uh, or leading into next year. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing between December and February, probably the Super Bowl. Super Bowl will probably be the best time for them to release a trailer. You know, it's been a long time since there's been a Jurassic Park movie, and um, you know, while everybody knows Jurassic Park, everyone and their mother's seen it. Uh, I think the the Super Bowl will probably be the best time to drop a trailer on everybody because I think that'll get everybody fired up and then lead it right into uh, the release later on that year. So I'm going to guess Super Bowl is probably when you'll see the first one. Um, but it would be great if we see one sooner. That would be fantastic. Uh, I'm dying to see what they've done. Uh, there have been great images that have been put up uh, to give us an idea of what we can expect. Uh, obviously, we've seen the, what the park looks like, or at least a concept of the park. At least it's rumored. Um, you know, now the, the other good thing for Jurassic World is after, uh, after Guardians of the Galaxy and... Uh, Chris Pratt's performance there, I mean, I think that's only going to help Jurassic World even more. You know, it's going to help it even more now because he did such a great job in that movie and everybody seems to like him. And he's got such a good um, presence on the screen in terms of really, he's very charismatic, very likable. So I think that is going to carry over into Jurassic World. So I think that was a great thing. Uh, for the Jurassic World movie is that he did such a great job in Guardians of the Galaxy that I, it's it's almost a guarantee that people who were a fan of that movie and really enjoyed it and enjoyed his performance, that's just going to catapult them over to Jurassic World. Even if they're not such a big dinosaur fan, uh, just to want to see his performance there because, you know, Jurassic World is another movie that's, you know, it's had moments in the movie where it's very lighthearted, a lot of comedy. Uh, obviously, we all remember Jeff Goldblum from the Jurassic Park series uh, back in the 90s. It was very funny in the first movie. Uh, second movie as well uh, had some funny moments. So I think I think we can expect that in this movie as well. And it's going to come from him. Obviously, we've seen that he can do it. So that's that's going to be exciting. And, um, you know, Bryce Dallas Howard, you know, she's interesting because she, I mean, she's a very pretty girl. And she she's had some movies where, you know, uh, for example, when she played Gwen Stacy in uh, the third Spider-Man movie, the first set of the franchise, uh, you know, a lot of people were, you know, not too crazy about that. Uh, she was in the Twilight series. Uh, she replaced a very, very popular actress. Uh, she, the actress, actually, I don't remember her name, but she stars in the Under the Dome now. I believe she's still on that series. But she played the original character in that movie named Victoria, 
Bryce Dallas Howard took over and, uh, you know, she's always had roles where it's not that she's such a bad performer, but where the, the crowd of that particular franchise or genre, they just don't warm up to her replacing somebody else or playing a certain role. But um, I, so I'm excited to see her here uh, in this movie um, to see how she does. She's very pretty. I, I've always liked her. I think she's fine. Um, so I, I think she'll do well. I think uh, obviously um, Chris will do excellent. I can't wait to see how he does in this movie. So I'm excited. But yeah, in terms of the trailer, I think trailer will be Super Bowl. I think that's when it's going to drop. I think it makes the, the, the best sense to me. Uh, could we see it sooner? Absolutely. Absolutely. I think there's definitely a chance we can see it sooner. We could see it as soon as what I think is possibly Interstellar. You might see a, a teaser. You know, they might drop a teaser on us real quick before they, they go with a big full trailer. So if we go teaser, I'm going to say somewhere between the release of Interstellar leading into the end of the year. But in terms of a full-fledged trailer, I really think it's going to be the Super Bowl. I think that'll be the best time in my opinion, for them to do it if they want to invest that kind of money. But we'll have to wait and see. But Jurassic World's done shooting. They're going to finish touching it up. As we all know, that's how it goes down. And then it's on to next year, until the movie. And then from that point, from this point on, it's going to be, you know, continued uh, discussions, articles, trailers. Obviously, is the big thing we all want to see at some point. And, uh, yeah, yeah, hopefully it looks good. You know, I can't wait. I definitely can't wait to see a trailer. Uh, so we'll see what happens. So what do you guys think? Do you, get, you guys think it'll be Super Bowl? Do you think it'll be sooner? Do you think you might see a teaser in Interstellar? What about you? What do you predict for the uh, Jurassic World trailer uh, between now and the movie release? When do you think we'll see it? This is Rob signing off for ETN, where we don't do news. We just talk entertainment. Take it easy. Thank you for watching ETN. Don't forget to subscribe and join the Nation Facebook page.